Guys, we have a smart watch. Wedding a healthy lifestyle. This day, model W26 Plus, and you have IP68 waterproofing. Uh, and you can see the informations, but it has a big flaw. Let me show you. There is a manual and the tiny, tiny writings here. You can read it. Next, we have a charging cord and the watch itself. Okay, there is nothing in this package. So, problem is it is not turning on. If I hold the power button, nothing is happening. So, we have the charging connector here, the golden pads. Okay. So, this one should connect here, right? So, this connector have two magnets here and there, if you can see. And if I put a a pretty strong magnet I think they are neodymium magnets and the watch has two magnets over here if you can see two magnets here and here so if we connect it here like see it is repelling one magnet is attracting and one is repelling this one so the magnet orientation is not correct so this is the original charging cable i have here with the package and it's not connecting and the magnet orientation is wrong so this is no charge at all it's new product just unboxed it so what we have to do now we can buy a new cable or we can try to fix it before fixing we have to check <clears throat> the cable is working or not so you can see two connectors one is positive and one is negative because it is an USB so there is must uh, DC current no doubt about that so we have our multimeter here bank can connect here and we will measure the voltage here so just keep it so that you can see better okay it's 5.1 the cable is working fine so we can we know that the, this uh, charger is working properly okay so there is minus I mean this is the plus and this is the minus I can show you show you one more thing that when a device is connected in this power bank particularly the light should be on without any switch so if if we connect the watch like that the light is on so charge is passing if I hold it like that the watch is not turning on whatsoever so we have to keep it on charge like a 10 or 20 minutes or uh, so I cannot hold it right there like like this hold it forever no we can tape it down we can use some tape but Solution is we have to remove this magnet because this magnet is not attaching. Okay, this this one is attaching. This, this one is uh, this and one is the uh, oriented right. This one is not. So we have to remove this. So this is good in this place. So how can we, we do this? So we have a solution. We have a solution. Not we. I have a solution. Solution is to like warm it up and then 
use some strong um, iron like things iron or something hold it and pull it this way we can remove this so we need a soldering iron and it is cleaned okay it's cleaned and it is hot okay if we uh, we can use the like it is hot so you should clean it first of all you should clean it then we have to hold it in here like uh, we should uh, make it warm so we're trying to make it warm like 5 to 10 seconds so that we don't melt the plastics we just uh, want to soften the glue now it's warm but still I cannot break it so what is the other solution then we have to take it apart and then we can try so what we have to do like I'm using my fingernail <clears throat> you can use some uh, plastic tools or something like that to break the glue okay it's glued shut so I'm using brute force and my nails to pull it up and it's pretty strong so I'm, I'm doing this why why I'm doing this I'm doing this because uh, we don't have any scratches or something like that so if I pull it like with my nails there will not be any scratch okay there we go so now we are officially open okay but we destroyed okay there's no doubt we broke the plastic here like that uh, there is no problem because we can fix it uh, the main thing is our magnet is down so we will lose this one like that so we have these two magnets and we will use the proper orientation so that we can fix the problem and make it like new again so first of all we have to take one magnet one and just keep it right there and keep this one over here this is the right orientation of course and we will mark it like this one is going inside like this you see next we have to put this on this and this and then we're good to go why because uh, first we have to fix the fix the uh, cable inside this like so there's one drop of glue used there's no glue just like that like look if you can see it clearly then we have like this like that okay like it is now fixed so we have to put the magnets like what we did before like that and we just have to push the magnets right side so we're fixed so the magnets are inside and now it is fixed and now if we can see you can see right I put the charger here and now the light is on the watch is officially charging but I'm not sure so we will keep it right like that and see any live show comes on so you can see clearly the watch is charging 
so now the I have charged it for about 20 minutes let's see okay it's vibrating and charging so it's very easy to fix if you have a proper tool like my nail of course no it's not you can use some pair of tweezers or some pry tool and you're good to go but you will have some scratches like uh, we broke here and it, it is not visible really and it, it will not uh, do anything with uh, your performance or like so okay so if we you know misalign let's see if it's charges no it's not so we have to remove the orientation like that oh yeah it's charging so let's uh, let's turn it on and let's see what's inside So, uh, this is clearly an LCD, rotary switch, and of course touch, English. So this is the watch face, faces, like, there is a torch, <laughs> oh my god, okay. Bluetooth, microphone, style one, style two. Okay. Bluetooth is not connected. So this is uh, this is the thing. And I'm not going deep enough because uh, you can see many many uh, what I can say. Now how to fix the times or how to connect in blue with bluetooth something like that you can find many 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 you know tutorials my main goal was here to show you how to fix the you know how to fix the charging port and how to you know if there is misalignment from the factory you can fix it or you can buy a new one if you have enough money so thank you for watching and Happy fixing.